Right, I'm back from vacation. What exactly did I miss? The Ryzen 7000 series. We now see 13 the Ryzen 7950X in desktop the fastest 16 core 7950X. Now, we also designed it. So yeah, while I was away, AMD just casually announced all the details for the upcoming Ryzen 7000 CPUs. So uh Great timing there, but I can't stay mad for long because these CPUs are just so good. Even if there's one unfortunate truth to them that not many people are talking about. Firstly, let's get the obvious out of the way. They are fast. I mean, what do you do? Who would have thought a brand new generation of CPUs is faster than previous? But no, no, no. These things are really fast, with all the announced SKUs so far boosting way beyond the 5 GHz mark and even the 7600X completely wipes the floor with the Intel flagship, the 12900 k Or at least the Intel flagship if you don't count the 12900 ks which is kind of in a league of its own with its price and insane heat output. And in pretty much all areas, be it gaming or productivity, you should see huge boosts in performance compared to previous gen AMD and Intel CPUs. And with four SKUs to choose from right now, you have tons of choice when it comes to the perfect CPU for you. And Praise Lisa Sue, we have no Ryzen 7600 or Ryzen 7800X to complicate the product stack. So the product stack is nice and ready to be messed up by the 3D Vcash CPUs that are launching sometime next year. Regardless of all of that, the pricing itself is also pretty decent, ranging all the way from $300 for the 7600X all the way to $700 for the 7950X. So while you may be thinking, whoa, that AMD, $300. That ain't really budget. Don't worry, like with previous generations, more budget Ryzen 3 SKUs will most likely launch next year. But here we get to the ugly truth. Compared to Intel old lake pricing, I mean, these things are kind of expensive. Not to mention that given these prices, you can bet that the upcoming Intel Rack Lake CPUs are going to be priced extremely aggressively. Now, of course, that doesn't really matter as much, seeing how much extra performance you get for that money, but still, that's just something to look out for. But the news just gets worse for a, you know, combined poor abused wallet. And that is the fact that not only you're going to need a brand new motherboard for the brand new AM5 socket, but also DDR5 memory. And oh boy, DDR5 memory is still a joke. The pricing for this thing is insane right now, and because of the boosted capacity, you can't even really get 16GB kits anymore, which for many people is still more than enough. So many people might be paying for more gigabytes than they really need. Also, have I mentioned the pricing is insane? Because yeah, the pricing is still absolutely insane. And the new motherboards probably aren't gonna be cheap either because they're new on a brand new socket with more features than ever. But hey, at the very least, you can have three different chipsets to choose from so you can go for something more budget or something way more out there if you wanted. So at least the motherboard product stack isn't confusing and they just leaked B650E. AMD, why do you do this to me? But anyway, let me know what you think of all of this down in the comments below. And hey, why is we here? If you like this video and all my awful, awful jokes, then good for you for having strange taste. Why not celebrate by checking out our Patreon, which is going to be down in the video description below. Because even just one single dollar month truly goes a long way, while you get awesome perks as well. I'd also love to thank my existing patrons, Gavin Burns, Ryan, Ella Vroniak, LKB, Meg Sumner, Shane Allcroft, Lansby, and Jesse Herbman. Thank you guys so, so much for support. It truly goes a long way. Down here you can find our Amazon links if you want to get some DDR5 memory for your upcoming Ryzen 7 thousand pc plus and it's also our discord server and our social media links as well plus also our merch store but anyway that's all it's i hope you enjoyed this video if you didn't remember subscribe like whatever and i'll see you all in whatever i make next goodbye everyone good bye